Since you can't be live to greet new viewers 24 7. New viewers 24 7. Create a trailer. Hello and welcome. <coughs> gonna take the um, Ritchieville map and I think I'm gonna switch sides. I wanna put Ritchieville on the left, I wanna put Ritchie's Island on the right. We're gonna take uh, a good bit of the files from the Ritchie Island map and get them into the Ritchieville map so we can start building and updating the Ritchieville map to all of the uh, fill types and fill planes and particle effects that match the new islands map so eventually we can use all of the placeables on all three maps so but the first thing we need to do is we need to get and I don't know if they're in the islands folder or if they're in the common files uh, textures, terrain. Yeah, so this should have, it does, all right. Now in the old folder, I think it's textures, no, it is maps, textures, terrain. Yes, so I want to get the copper and nickel into the new map or into Ritchieville first. Yep, so this is the folder we want to put them in, but we're going to have to resize them because the existing files, we're going to go uh, copy I'm going to paste it in here and it needs to be DTX5 and it needs to be 512 by 512. Um, on the diffuse. So let's grab the four copper diffuses. I'm going to copy them out of the islands map we're going to paste them into this map 
and they are going to be 2048 by 2048. Copy, paste. There we go. These are 2048 by 2048, and they are DTX5. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to open these with Paint.net, image, resize, 512 by 512. Uh, and we go file, save as, uh, copper one diffuse. But yes, I'm going to replace it, and it needs to be DTX5. Now, I just want to double check that. Let's see what the, make sure the coal is. So I'm going to go, again, I'm just going to go copy. I'm going to paste it into there, and it's going to tell me, yeah, that it's a DTX5 512 by 512. So we just need to change the rest of these coppers. Open with paint.net. First one I'm going to delete. Image, resize, 512 by 512. And we're going to save it. Copper Diffuse 2. Yes, and it's a DTX 5. Copper Diffuse 3. We are going to delete that one. We're gonna go File, or sorry, Image, Resize, 512 by 512. We are going to save that one. I'm going to, and it's going to be DTX5. And we're going to take Copper Diffuse 4. We're going to open that with PaintNet. Get rid of this one. File, no, sorry, Image, Resize, 512 by 512. File, save as, and uh, DTX5. Now I need the normal files, so one, two, three, and four. I'm going to copy them over, and our normal files, let's check the coal. Uh, so if we go here, we go copy and paste. These are also 5x512 five by, by five and a DTX5. So it's copper normal 1, open with paint.net. Uh, we're going to resize this to 512 by 512. I'm going to replace it and it's going to be DTX5. Copper normal 2. Image resize 512 by 512. Copper normal three. Uh, I'm going to go image resize five twelve by five twelve. And copper normal four. Go image resize five twelve by five twelve. 
and we're going to save that one as a DTX five. So that's our copper texture files. Let's grab the nickel texture files and we'll do the same thing. Let's grab the diffuse first. We'll paste them into uh, Richieville. We'll do one at a time. Open with paint.net image resize 512 by 512. Make sure it's a DTX 5. Nickel 2. Image resize so five twelve by five twelve. Uh, nickel diffuse three. Save as DTX5. I don't know if I needed to generate mint maps or not. Mm, I may have to go back and resave these. We'll see if we get any errors when we go in game. Um, let's just get nickel 4 done. And I want to check something. Open with paint.net. Uh, image resize 512 by 512. And let's go file save as uh, DTX5. Well, I'm curious. Let's take our coal. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to stick it back in here. And it's telling me it has one of ten MIP maps. So let's check the copper. Copy. Uh, paste. And it's telling me it has one of one. So I'm going to just leave it for now and then we'll see if we have to fix it later. Oh, let's get our normal Images over, uh, open with paint.net. That's the longest part is just getting everything resized down to from the 16x scale down to the 4x scale. Normal 2. Five twelve by five twelve. Uh, normal three. Five twelve by five twelve. and then normal 4. Open that. Uh, oh, image resize 512 by 512. Right, I'm just going to close paint.net for now. So we have our copper in, 
we have our nickel in and then we are going to redo the ore textures but I want to get the copper and the nickel in first and then we'll come back and we'll mess with the ore this ore is going to be a little bit easier so those are our textures now I'm going to go um, I'm going to go back to um, Richieville, back to maps. Now I'm going to go into map. We need weight files. And the weight files, let's find coal so we know it's correct. So we'll go by the coal. So coal. I'm just going to, I'm going to go. Oh slide this down a little bit further. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to paste it into here. And this is a PNG file. So we this is not a DDS file. It's a PNG. And these are already 2048 by 2048. So these are all 2048 by 2048. <clears throat> Let's see what our weight files are in the 16x map. So uh, Ritchie Islands, map SA. These are 4096 by 4096. Alright, so we're not going to be able to use those, but we are going to have to go 2048 by 2048. Our blank one is 2048 by 2048. So I'm going to copy, paste, uh, rename uh, nickel. CK. If I can spell K E L O one underscore weight I think it was Nick EL make sure I'm spelling it right N I C K E L yep so that was nickel 01 uh, copy paste rename nickel O2 weight uh, paste it in rename nickel O3 weight uh, we're going to paste another one in and we're going to rename it Nickel O four weight, and we're going to paste it in. We are going to rename it Copper O one weight. I'm going to paste it in. We're going to rename it Copper 02 Weight. Paste it in. Rename it Copper 03 Weight. Uh, paste that one in. Copper 04 weight. So we have our texture files in, we have our weight files in. Now let's go back to Ritchieville maps. We're going to open up the map i3D with Notepad. Farmchick63, good morning. I am starting to get the new textures in the Ritchieville map.
so we can get it matching the new islands map. Um, for a reference, I'm going to go Control F, and we're going to go Coal. And then we are going to copy these, uh, paste them in, and we're going to change this to Copper 01, Copper 02, Copper 03, and Copper 04, but let me grab my notebook and a clean page. Copper and nickel. We are going to name this. We're going to. This one has to be. So let's go three thousand three thousand and one. 3002, 3003. These will um, eventually renumber themselves as soon as we save and go in game. And sorry, I'm just making myself a note in my notebook so I know how I number them. Yeah, it's going to be really cool once these are rebuilt because then we can use the mod packs on all three maps. All three maps will have will be identical. All right, we are going to paste that in again, but this time we're going to go NICK Nickel 01. Nickel 02. Nickel O three, Nickel O four, and these are going to be four thousand, four thousand and one, four thousand and two. And 4003. So we're going to save that. So those are our weight files. Uh, now we have to put our texture files in. And again, we're going to copy coal. And we're going to go to coal. This is going to be, we'll do copper first. going to, again, just grab my notebook and I'm going to make some notes really quick. So our copper diffuse 
01, 02, 03, and 04. And then we're going to have normal 01, 02, 03, and 04. So our diffuse, a one is going to be three thousand and four. Our diffuse two is going to be three thousand and five. This is going to be three thousand and six. That's going to be 3,007. Our copper normal one is going to be 3,008. 3009, 3010, and 3011. So I'm going to save that and then we're going to do the same thing with our nickel. It's going to be nickel O1, if I can spell L-I-C-K-E-L, nickel, nickel, Some notes on my O five, O six, O seven. So this one's going to be four thousand and four. Four thousand and five. Four thousand and six, four thousand and seven, four thousand eight, four thousand nine, four thousand and ten. And 4011. Another quick save. Now, our this one we don't need yet. Uh, we'll come back to that one. Now we've got to get our copper and our nickel in here again. So we're going to copy the coal. And we're going to call it, this is going to be copper 01, copper 02, copper 03. Copper O four. Now our D 
detail for copper O1, our detail for copper O1 was 3,000. Three thousand and one. Three thousand and two. Three thousand and three. Our normal. Oh no, that was our weight file. Crap, crap, crap. All right, so I, I got to undo those. All right, so our weight ID was three thousand. 3001, 3002, 3003, our detail, oh, I think. all right, yep, so this is our, our detail is our diffuse. This was three thousand and four, three thousand and five, three thousand and six, and three thousand and seven. And our normal is three thousand and eight, three thousand and nine. 3010 and 3011. Because our coal is 131, we'll go back up and check. I think that's our, our uh, normal numbers, but, uh, but that's our copper. Uh, we'll go back up and check that in a second. I'm pretty sure I got that correct. So this is our nickel. Our nickel. Our nickel. And our nickel. So our weight. Four thousand, four thousand and one, four thousand and two, four thousand and three, four thousand and four, four thousand five. 4,006, 4,007, 4,008, 4,009, 4,010, 4,011. Uh, so let's save that a second. So that should be our copper and our nickel for our paint layers. Now our, I just want to scroll up top real quick and I'm going to come right back down. So our coal should have been 131 and it should have been our normal number. Coal is, okay that's the weight. Our texture, yeah, 131, arc diffuse, so yeah, so we got it right below. So let's head back down to where we were. So here's our copper, here's our nickel. Now we have to get our combined layers in. So we will... Uh, we will copy this. And we will call this copper 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 copper, 
copper and copper and then we'll do the same thing with nickel so you become nickel you become nickel you become nickel and you become nickel so let's save that alright so our next instance of coal is the coal mine so that should be all of our Yep, so we have our weight files in for copper and nickel. We have our terrain in for copper and nickel. We'll come back to the diffuse. And then we have our layers done for copper and nickel, and we have our combined layers done for copper and nickel. So for now, I am going to close the map I3D. Now we have to go, I'm going to refer back to the new map so I remember where it's at. Alright, so yep. <coughs> so we need the, it is Richieville and I need the I think it's under maps yep I need the map DE file and then the same thing down here we are going to copy coal And we're going to call this copper and copper nickel and nickel. And I'm just going to search coal to make sure I didn't miss anything. So it's only the one instance. So that folder is done. <coughs> now we have to go to... Um, we're going to go to the islands map. I want to go to fill planes. We have copper, so Ritchieville fill planes. I'm going to open up the copper I3D. I'm going to go file. I'm going to go export selection with files. We're going to go documents, my games, mods. Uh, Richieville fill planes and we're gonna go copper and now this one should have copper it does now do we have to resize this texture file it is 512 by 512 um, and it can stay 512 by 512 so that one should be fine so let's grab our nickel alright so we've got our nickel can I open this one up from the new map I'm gonna go file, I'm gonna export it 
into the Ritchieville map. And then that should get our nickel in the new map. If I can spell... Alright, so our nickel is in the map, and we have our texture files as well, so they transferred over. Yep, we have our shaders, we have everything we need, and bring in our nickel over. Now we have to go to the fill plane material holder. and scroll down so we have coal duplicate that move it up let's go you become copper you become copper you become copper and this one becomes copper and you become copper so that's all copper that is not all, all copper and that is not all copper so let's take this one, we'll duplicate it again, I'll move it up, let's go nickel, this becomes nickel, you become nickel, and then you become nickel. and you become nickel. So you're all changed. You're all changed and you're all changed. So let's save this and close it. And now we have, that was our fill plane material holder. Alright, so that's our fill plane material holder. Now we have to go back to our map DE and we added two fill planes in. We added in our fill plane copper and we added in our fill plane nickel. Alright, so that's our fill planes. Now we have to go to our particle systems and I'm going to go view uh, icons because I like to look at that better. So we have our fill planes. So we have to come over here. I'm in our particle effects. So I'll come over here. We'll grab particle systems. Let's grab our Um, our pipe effects. So our pipe copper file export selection with files, Ritchieville particle systems, our pipe copper our pipe nickel X 
export that into the Ritchieville map. We need our unload particles. So we should have an unload copper. Uh, file, I'm going to export that in here. And then we should have our unload nickel. Export this in. Uh, all right, so let's come back over here. We should have cutter effect. We won't have to do anything with effect material holder. Unloading. Coal. I'm going to duplicate. We're going to name it copper. Um, this becomes copper. This becomes copper. This one becomes copper. This is copper, and then this is copper, and this becomes copper. Right, copper, uh, copper copper and copper. Alright, so let's duplicate this. It becomes nickel. Uh, this one becomes nickel. This one becomes nickel. That becomes nickel. That one becomes nickel. That one becomes nickel. Alright, so save that. There's smoke. Should have a coal. Duplicate that. Call you copper. And that can stay like it is. Duplicate it again. Nickel. And then that can stay like it is. There's no straw. We're not, we're not, we don't need to put it in a spray or a spreader. Pipe. Uh, we will duplicate that. We'll call you copper. Uh, you become copper. You become copper. You become copper. You become copper. You become nickel. You become nickel. You are nickel. 
you are nickel. Save that. Uh, belt system. Coal. Duplicate. You become copper. Uh, and then you become copper. And you become copper. You are nickel. You are nickel. And you are nickel. All right. So save that. Leveler we don't need because we're not going to. I guess do we need. I have never. Oh, we do. All right. So let's duplicate coal, and we'll call you copper. And fill type is going to be copper. And you are nickel. And nickel. Uh. So we don't need it in a washer, and we don't need it in a pickup. So save you, and that's our effect material holder. And that it should be one more particle effect material holder. Uh, so our smoke, uh, we don't need it in here because I don't see coal. So I don't have to do anything there. Chopper we won't need. Unload we don't need. Spreader, cutter, soil, windrow, tether no, weeder no, forestry no, harvesting no, washer no. Alright, so this one we don't need to do anything with. But we do have to go back into here and put our unload Let's, we need our pipe. Alright, so we need our pipe. Copper. And our pipe. Nickel. And then for our unload. We have to add in our copper and our nickel, and we'll save that. Uh, we'll go back here. All right, so our fill planes are done. Our particle systems are done. We now we have to go into our fill types. Um, Grab our HUDs. Grab our HUDs. So we need nickel and copper. Oh, copper and copper. And our nickel. And so that's our HUDs. Now we have to go into Ritchieville. Uh, maps. Looking for the fill type. Oh, I'm sorry, it's back one. It is XML fill types. So let's come into our... The islands map, I'm going to go control find, I'm going to go copper. We are going to grab 
We don't want our copper rock just yet. Oh well, so let's do it the other way. So let's just go in here. Let's come down to our ores. And a lot of this is going to change. Let's find our coal. There we go. So let's take our coal. And we're just going to duplicate it. We're going to call this copper. And it's going to be copper. And our PNG is copper. And then we'll do the same thing with our nickel. And nickel. Our hut fill is going to be nickel. This will be nickel. Uh, and now we have to add it to our bulk. Um, and it doesn't matter where it goes. Uh, so we can add copper, nickel into our bulk. And we need to add it to our auger wagon. So let's go nickel and copper. So let's go here, nickel, and copper, uh, what other category is it in? It's in our quarry, so let's go nickel and copper and it's in our loading vehicles nickel and copper and that's our fill types Oh, come on. There we go. So we have our fill types, our nickel and our copper. In here, uh, so we have our fill planes are taken care of, our fill types are taken care of. Uh, don't need anything with foliage. We have our weight files taken care of, our particle systems are taken care of, textures are taken care of, tip on ground. And we got to get our tip on ground over next. So I'm um, going to see what this is. I'm going to go copy. I'm going to go paste. It's going to be a DTX 5 and it's going to be 512 by 512. Let's go our islands map. Let's go to our tip on ground. And we need copper, 
copper, copper. And we need nickel, nickel, and nickel. We're going to copy these into here. And our coal was DTX5, 512 by 512. I want to go copy. I want to paste it in here. And it's 512 by 512 DTX5. So the sizing is correct. <coughs> so that's our tip on ground textures. Now we need our tip on ground XML. And then we have to add, uh, we can duplicate the coal. And we can come down here to the bottom. I'm going to call this one copper. And it's going to be copper. And it's going to be copper. And it is going to be copper. And now we're going to do another one. And we're going to call it nickel. It is nickel. is nickel and it is nickel. Now I am going to remove a couple of tip on grounds because we just have way too many and hit this map. We don't need to dump mustard on the ground and we don't need to dump millet on the ground. And I'm probably going to eliminate a lot of these in this file eventually. So that is our tip on ground. Uh, tobacco we don't need to touch. Now I think we are ready to see if we have copper and nickel in the editor first. So we're going to go Ritchieville, Maps. Let's pull up the editor. Give this a second to load. I'm going to grab a sip of coffee. Grab my coffee. Try not to spill. Knock my iced tea over. Alright, so... Um, yeah, it doesn't matter where we are. I just want to see if we have our nickel and our copper textures in here. So if we go to here, our textures, we should now have copper and nickel. Yep, so we should now have copper. And something's wrong because that does not look like copper. So what did I mess up? and nickel. You know, I think I needed to open up the map first. Oh, I know what I needed to do. Crap. Alright, so let's exit without saving. I needed to open up this because they have to renumber themselves. I forgot. I gotta open it, save it, close it, and then go back in. Hope I didn't mess all that up. We just gotta go back in and redo it. So let's save this. I may have just trashed everything I did this morning. Putting new textures in a map are a complete nightmare. So 
just waiting for this to save. All right, so we're just going to close this out, and now we're going to open it up again, and hopefully I didn't really mess it up and have to start over. Right, so let's try this again. Uh, animal mod, I want copper. Now I messed something up. What did I do wrong? And our nickel. Yeah, something's not right. Something is definitely not right. It's got to be my weight files have got to be wrong. Or I didn't save, or I needed the mint maps, they're all saved wrong. Uh, Alright, so let's go back and retrace our steps. Uh, I want to go to Ritchieville, I want to pull my textures back up. Uh, oh, we didn't put our texture files in. We don't need texture files in here yet. I needed them in here. Maps. Terrain. Uh, where's our coal? Copy. Paste. Yeah, I think I forgot to save them with the mint map. So let's go back in and let's go to our copper. Uh, we're going to save. We're going to go DTX5, but we're going to generate mint maps this time. I'm hoping that did it. If not, then I'm going to have to just retrace my steps off camera and see what I did wrong. But I just want to save these again uh, and generate the mint maps this time. I, I'm hoping that's all I did wrong. And our nickel. So I thought when I was actually creating these that I needed to generate the mint maps, but I just... It's been a while since I've added new textures to the map, and they are a nightmare. So if we go maps, maps, no, map, let's grab our weight file, let's 
grab our coal. Oh, and these don't have maps because they're a PNG. Alright, let's see if that did it or if I've completely messed this up and I just need to go back and start over. save this and close it and then reload it one more time to be sure. I could have, re I could have numbered something wrong in the i3D itself. close this and we're going to reload it. Alright, so let's try this again and see what I messed up. Uh, copper there we go. And we should now have nickel in the map. Alright, so we have our copper, we have our nickel. Perfect. So we can get out of here. I'm not going to save it. We are going to... No, I don't want you full size. We're going to minimize you. We're going to minimize you. We are going to go into our Richieville unzipped game oh, I'm gonna go career save game one is going to be a trash because None of this current, none, <coughs> none of the current save games are going to be any good anymore. Uh, so let's go into Richieville, and I'm just going to leave all the old mods in here for the time being. I want to see if we actually have our fill planes and particle effects in the map correctly. Uh, so let's head... Well, I don't think I've been in this map for over a year. Let's head over to the vehicle shop. Let us... Uh, do I have it in here? No, I don't. Let's go to trucks. Let's grab the. Let's lease this guy. And let's lease the slide on tipper. this one. I'm hoping I don't have to go in and edit it to add nickel and copper to it, but let's just give it a shot. So let's grab this guy. And then we're going to have to throw some money in here. 
and then we're going to just have to buy the whole map for now, just for testing. Alright, so, let's get you over here, because we're not going to save this anyway, in case I need to spawn any more vehicles in. Alright, so let's zoom back in a little bit. Let's see if we have our copper and our nickel in here. Yep, here's our nickel. That looks like our nickel texture. Oh, are you gonna let me... Yeah, you should dump on the ground. So there is our nickel. Uh, let's empty you. Let's put some copper in there. You are my copper texture, and you are dumping on the ground, so stop. So that is fantastic. We should be able to walk on it. It should not be invisible. All right, so cool. We have our nickel, and we have our copper in the new map. And then in-game, we should be able to paint in... Uh, We should be able to paint in copper and nickel as well. Let's go paint. No! Alright, let's go painting. And we should have copper and nickel in here, but I don't remember what the textures look like. Uh, let's see if we can find them. So we should be able to paint these new textures in as well. Yep. Here is our nickel, so we could paint that in. And where's our copper? That was the nickel. There's our copper. So there's our nickel, there's our copper. So they're now in game. All right. So we can get out of here. Yeah, I don't want to save. And first thing I want to do is I want to check the log for errors. Now I'm going to have a ton of vehicle errors because it's not updated. But I want to make sure there's no errors with music player maximum local files. Oh, sorry. Down too far. Let's go all the way up to the top. Uh. Waterfall Creek emitter, so we'll fix that later, but there's no errors at all with our new copper and our new nickel. So that is... That's good. We have our copper and we have our nickel in the map. Now I want to get the new ore texture in the map. Um, so we're going to go back to Ritchieville. We're going to go... This one's going to be a little bit easier. Um, our fill planes, our ore, yeah, so we have to change out our ore here. So we need our ore diffuse, our ore normal, and our ore specular. And I'm just going to copy. I'm going to paste, and it's going to be DTX 1 512 by 512. So let's grab our new map. 
let's go to fill planes let's grab our new ore I don't like the old ore texture. So we're going to grab our ore, diffuse our ore normal and our ore specular. We're going to paste them in and yes, I'm going to replace them. I'm going to go copy. Oh, I'm going to paste that in. Oh, come on. Oh, one. Copy. Paste. DTX 5, 512 by 512. So this needs to be DTX 1, 512 by 512, I believe. Uh, copy, paste. Yeah, it needs to be DTX 1. So let's open with paint. Let's save it as a DTX 1. Now our normal texture is a DTX 1, 512 by 512. So we're just going to open it with paint.net. We're going to save it as a DTX 1. And then our uh, specular, our mustard specular we'll go by that one or yeah let's go by our mustard specular uh copy paste it is also a dtx one so we're going to open with paint we're going to save it as a dtx one so those are our fill planes uh, for the new copper texture, or the new ore texture. Let's go to our particle effects. And do we have ore? No, so we, there's no a particle of system should be good. We got to go to our textures. Now our textures are uh, maps, textures, terrain, and then we have to get the new ore over here. So it is Ritchie Islands. No, it's not. It is common files, textures, terrain. And I want to get the ore. The new ore textures. I think I only need the ore diffuse and the ore normal. See how it is in the old map. So oh, so he does have all four. So we're, this is going to be a little bit longer than I thought. And now we're going to have to change the weight files out as well. Yeah, you're 512 by 512. And your DTX 5. And I'm going to have to resize you guys. Now, what's our normal? Okay. 
okay copy paste all right so you're also DTX5 all right so we're gonna have to do this the hard way so let's go or and or copy uh, paste uh, open with paint.net image resize 512 by 512 save it as a DTX 5 and we'll generate the mint maps and then our or normal open with paint.net uh, image resize 512 by 512 Save this, DTX5. So these two, we are going to uh, delete. So you are now or O or a one diffuse and you are or normal a one diffuse now two three and four we are going to delete so or one I'm gonna go image rotate 90 degrees clockwise file save as and you're going to be or 2 DTX 5 I'm going to go image rotate file save as you are going to be 03 diffuse we're going to go image, we're going to go rotate, we are going to go file, save as, and you become 04 diffuse. So let's close you, let's grab this one, open with paint.net, image, rotate, save as 02, File, oh no, image, rotate, file, save as, 03, image, rotate, file, save as, 04. Alright, so close you. So there's our four new ore textures are for normal textures. Now let's go into maps map and we are going to have to make new weight files for our or since we changed the texture. So or 01 weight 02 weight, 03 weight, and 04 weight. I'm going to delete. We are going to come down here. We are going to copy this. We are going to paste it in. Rename it or 01 underscore weight. Uh, paste, rename, or 02 underscore weight, uh, 
paste it in, rename it, or 03, wait, paste it in, rename it, 404, wait. So there's our four new wait files. Since we have four new texture files. Alright, so back to Ritchieville, back to now tip on ground. Our tip on ground for our ore is still the old textures. So common file uh, 16x, Ritchie Islands, uh, tip on ground. We need our new ore textures. So ore diffuse. What do we have? We have a diffuse normal and distance diffuse. So we have our ore diffuse normal and distance diffuse. We're going to copy those. We are going to paste them in. Now our nickel. Nickel diffuse copy is a DTX five five twelve by five twelve. This new one is DTX five five twelve by five twelve. So these should all be good. Uh, Richieville. Uh, particle systems, I think, is going to be good. All right, so let's just go to Ritchieville. Let's let's just go ore, and we'll see if there's any other old ore textures we need to change out. Uh, We may what file you in uh, Richieville textures. So Richieville textures. I swear that's where you were. Let's try that again. Let's search the whole file for ore mods Richieville textures. Richieville textures. Oh, there is an ore in here. Okay. And what are you? Uh, you are 2048 by 2048, and you are a DTX 5. So let's take our ore diffuse. Right, you're called or diffuse. So let's copy you. Uh, we will paste you in here. We're going to open you with paint.net. Image resize. You were 2048 by 2048, and I don't know why. Uh, so let's save you, and you were DTX5. So let's go back here to ore. I don't. Th I think that's all of our ores. So we have our ore textures terrain. We fixed our terrain textures. Uh, what file are you in? You were terrain, so you're done. Our weight files are done. So I think all of our ore should now be uh, the new color. So let's go into maps. Let's go into the editor. And it's probably messed up all of our existing ore that was on the ground, but we're going to delete it anyway. So I just want to see if I can paint in the new ore. Yep, 
yeah, so you're the new ore color. We got rid of that crazy ass red looking ore. Let's fly over here to the mine a second. And we'll see if our new ore is in here. Or if it messed up the textures. Oh, we're gonna have to oh it did it repainted the no we're gonna this this is all getting trashed anyway. Which one were you? You are coal. Where's our ore? This is our ore. Yeah, and we're gonna have to come in here and redo this anyway. So our, it did mess up our textures. We're gonna have to repaint it. But now we go in game. We should have the new ore. What I'm probably gonna do is I'm probably just gonna clean out this mods folder off camera so we're only loading the map and then we'll just put whatever mods in one at a time that we need. But I'll do that off camera when I take a lunch break. So we go. <laughs> Back to the store. Uh, let's grab some money. Let us buy the whole map and let me get a little bit of speed. All right, so let's get our tipper. Let's get our truck. And then this should have the new ore texture that's not red. here. Yeah, so this is the new ore texture that's not red and we should be able to tip it on the ground. Yeah. So here's our new ore. Uh, let's head over here to the mines. Uh, what's close? Nothing's close that we can teleport to, is it? Oh, I'll come over here and we'll run over. So I want to see, I think we're going to have to put all the ore back in, but we're going to change these mines anyway. But this should have... Oh, it did change the ore. So we have the new ore, but we're going to yank this out anyway, because we're going to change the mines up anyway. So there's our new ore texture. So let's get out of here. minimize you. Now our the mods folder I'm working in, uh, I do want to come up here to the required mods for the new map. Where are they? Where's the required mod pack? Placeables, animal pens, required mod pack. I want to, I need a limit break mod. Um, I think that's the only one I need for now. Let's grab the Limit Break mod. Uh, let's just throw them all in for now. Uh, now let's just grab the Limit Break mod for now. So let's just copy that. Let's get that in here. And then I'll clean out all the junk mods 
uh, that I don't need while we're rebuilding later. All right, so now we want to come in here to Ritchieville. We're going to go to fill types. No, we're going to go to HUDs. We're going to come over here to Ritchie Islands. We're going to come to HUDs because we need Let's start off with Coal Rock. So we have, let me grab my notebook. Coal Rock. Copper Rock. And we'll get rid of the extra fill types later. So that's our copper rock. Here is our nickel rock. our nickel rock. Here is our ore rock. We are going to grab our just our straight rock, but I can't remember what it is in the old map. E -I -E -I -O. Oh, we got to change rock salt. Oh crap, that's another whole project. We got to change rock salt to sea salt. Alright, I-E-I-O. So we don't have rock, so let's grab our rock. Paste that over. And I think that's all of our rock. Stone and gravel is good. We're not changing those. All right, so that's everything from the new one. Uh, let's go to our fill types. We need our coal rock, or rock, copper rock, nickel rock. And we're going to put that into our old rock, I mean our old map. Uh, So that is our coal rock, our copper rock, our nickel rock, our ore rock, and then we also need just straight rock from here. And we're going to get that in here. So there is our rock. Now we're going to come down to here. Uh, we're going to find our uh, bulk. Uh, 
or are you? You should no no you're not bulk your piece. I think it's only coming in here. Yes, yeah, so we need our rock, our coal rock, our ore rock, our copper rock, and our nickel rock. One, two, three, four, five. I've got five on my list, so let's copy those and come down here to piece. And we're going to add in our rock, our coal rock, our ore rock, our cobble rock, and our nickel rock. And uh, I'm going to come back over here to piece. Where was it? Alright, hang on. Uh, it's this category. So, coal rock. I want you highlighted in green so I can see where else you're at. And I think that's it. Control F, our coal rock is there under piece. And I think that's the only place I have to put it in. Yes, yeah, so our new fill types are in. Now we got to change rock salt to sea salt. But I'm going to have to I'm going to have to go in and unpaint it from the old map first before we convert rock salt over to sea salt. I think. Alright, so let's save that. Let's crank up the old map one more time because I honestly can't remember. Let's see where all we have salt on the ground. get some speed and I think if I'm correct the only place that we have salt on this map is back at Sammy's so your sand you are gravel I think oh yeah we do we have a salt line here we're gonna have to remove So that's going to come out. So we have salt there. And is that all? We're, yeah, now we have. That's going to change. We have more gravel. All that's going to change. And I think the only other spot on the map that we have salt is back here at Sammy's. Uh, so let's just go back here a second. Oh no, that was the other map. Alright, so the Richie's Hollow map, I put a salt line back here. So it looks like we only have the one salt to eliminate from the map. And in the bottom corner, this map's going to change as well. 
Alright, so that's our only salt. So let's go back into uh, Richieville Maps Map. We should be able to go to Global Company, Sand, Salt, and our salt mine is over here. So I want to go uh, subtract, I want to go terrain detail height and yep let's get all the old salt off the ground it's not going to be in this map we're going to go with uh, sea salt so that should be all the salt that's on the ground Alright, so let us save this. Whenever I get my mod list failed, it usually means I'm offline, but I think I'm still streaming. I could be completely wrong, or I'm just standing here um, talking to myself for no reason. Alright, let's get out of here. Hope I'm not talking to myself. Kiwi Rob, hello. We are tearing apart Richieville and getting ready to rebuild it. So the first thing I'm going to need, I got copper in the new map. We have nickel in the new map. Now we need to change every instance of rock salt to sea salt. So both maps are the same. And so we're going to grab our sea salt huds from here. And we're going to put them in here. And now we're going to go to our fill type XML. I didn't, I, we have no rock salt in here. Oh, because we are on the wrong XML. Rock salt. Alright, so we're going to change. Rock salt is... Uh, we don't need it in here anymore. You are an auger wagon, so we are going to change this rock salt to sea salt. You are, what category? You're a train wagon, so we're going to change rock salt here to sea salt. Uh, quarry is going to be sea salt. What category are you? 
you're loading vehicles, so you need to go from rock salt to sea salt. If I can type... So you are now sea salt. Uh, rock salt up here becomes sea salt. Rock salt becomes sea salt. Becomes sea salt. So you become a sea salt. Uh, and then what category did I miss? Uh, bulk, yep, so our bulk needs to become sea salt. So that's all of our fill types. Our map tip to ground. Our rock salt now becomes sea salt. Uh, S E A S A L T, and we're going to have to change our tip on ground rock salt become sea salt. Uh, sea salt, not sea salt, salt. Sea salt. So this is our tip on ground. Save this. Now our tip on ground, our rock salt has to become sea salt. So uh, we are going to rename this sea salt. Sea salt. Uh, rock salt becomes sea salt. Um, so we took care now our fill planes. rock salt rock salt becomes sea salt our rock salt becomes sea salt and now we have to come up here to our fill plane material holder and our rock salt becomes sea salt rock salt becomes sea salt and this one becomes sea salt I'll save that so that's our uh, fill plane material holder. So that's all. Now sea salt and no rock salt.
Alright, now let's go to our... So, fill types is already done. HUDs was already done. We need our tip to ground was already done. Our particle systems. Particle systems. I don't see any texture files. So let's go into our effect material holder and our rock salt becomes sea salt. that to sea salt. Change that to sea salt. You are now sea salt. You are now sea salt. Our smoke salt become sea salt and that one is good straw we don't need chopper we don't need sprayer spreader uh, spreader no nope. pipe rock salt become a sea salt So you become sea salt, you become sea salt, you become sea salt, uh, mower no belt, change our belt from rock salt to sea salt and then that can stay like it is leveler uh, did I did we not have rock salt in here have our coal. Uh, Alright, so let's just duplicate you and call you sea salt. A washer and our pickup we don't need, so we can save you. That was our effect material holder. Now we should have a particle effect material holder. And our smoke. Uh, we don't have any. Our chopper, we don't have any in there. Our unload is good. Spreader is good. Cutter is good. Soil, windrow tether, weeder, forestry, harvesting. Nope, so this one is good. We don't need to make any changes in here. Now we do have to change our uh, where was it? Maps, textures, terrain. We should have salt in here that needs to become sea salt.
Yeah, so salt01 becomes sea salt you become sea salt you become a sea salt salt and you become sea salt now our that's our texture files let's go into map and we need our new weight files so I think these are just salt yeah, so I now you become sea salt. You become sea salt. Uh, and you should become sea salt. Now we have to go into Richieville. We have to go into maps. We have to go into our I3D. When do you think we'll be removing the old Richieville? Uh, probably at some point this weekend, I'm going to get all of the old mods because they're all going to be obsolete. Nothing from the Richieville or the Richie's Hollow section is going to work once I get the two maps updated. Um, so let's find anything that has to do with salt. So you are now sea salt. You are now sea salt. You are sea salt. And you are now sea salt. What did I do? Oh, I know what he did. All right, hold on. Okay, that was just weird. So you are sea salt, and you are sea salt. All right, so you are now sea salt you are sea salt Yeah, absolutely nothing from the um, the um, why do yes why hang on why am I missing a sea salt one diffuse and normal sea salt two diffuse and normal sea salt three diffuse and normal that is weird there should be a sea salt for normal. Texture is now sea salt. Uh, you are now sea.
sea salt. layer you are now going to be sea salt and you are going to become sea salt C salt one two three and or four weight files. I still say we're missing an O four diffuse or an O four normal. So let's go back down here. Four sixty. Yeah, we're missing a normal. What is our 505? Uh, let me go up to the top and I want to search our 505. So it's running off of our diffuse 04. Hmm. Okay, that's weird. I'm going to go in game and see what it looks like. But anyway, let's save this close our map a second. Now let's go back here to Ritchieville. See what we have left. So our mods Ritchieville texture file. Our texture file has to be fixed yet. Textures. Rename. Sea salt. What else did we miss? You are our fill planes. And you are our fill planes. So our fill planes. Salt. Becomes. Sea salt. Rename Sea Salt. What the hell? Oh, because we already have it in here. Okay, so these can just get deleted. Uh, what else do we have in the way of salt? That's it. Alright, so let's go to Maps. Let's open up the editor. Yeah, because nothing from the old Ritchieville map or Ritchie's Hollow map is going to work on the new Islands map. And nothing that's currently built for the Islands map is going to work on the Ritchieville or the Ritchie's Hollow map. So all that is going to change anyway. But let's make sure that we can paint in. Uh, we should have wrong one. We should now have sea salt instead of rock salt. If I didn't mess it up, nope, I know what we did wrong. We have to, oh, we do have sea salt. So we, okay, so that's good. Uh, so we can get out of here for now. But I do want to check one more thing. Uh, map. Uh, rock salt. This should now be sea salt. And 
this should now be seek salt. Why did that not come up when I queried the map? Let's go back here. Our salt mine, okay, so our salt mine is going to get completely removed from the map anyway. Uh, all right, so let us go in game really quick again just to make sure that our sea salt is working like it should. And we're going to get a bunch of errors telling me that there's no more rock salt. but I just want to make sure sea salt works. back to the store. Nope, down here. Uh, let's throw in some money. Let's buy the whole map and get a little bit of speed. So now if we get our uh, truck and our tipper we should now have sea salt instead of rock salt So we have our sea salt now instead of our rock salt. And I should be able to tip it out. Fantastic. So this is our sea salt now instead of rock salt. And then I should be able to paint in Now we should have, I don't know if that's it or not, no that's not it, that's our trash, there we go, this should be our salt texture, yeah, so we have our salt texture in here, and we have our sea salt instead of <laughs> rock salt. Now I'm going to check the log, but it's definitely going to tell me that I, um, I am missing rock salt as an invalid fill type now and everything. So that's going to become one big snowball effect now because we're going to have to change all of our silos from rock salt to sea salt. Uh, let's just scroll up to the top. So I, I'm going to make a note for myself what I have to fix now. So that factory is going to get completely eliminated. Uh, fill planes, salt diffuse. So we can't load our fill planes. Okay, so we have to go back into our fill plane material holder. 
can fix that. Uh, unknown fill type. Yeah, okay, so we missed something up in our fill types. So let's go to our fill planes first. And we definitely missed something up. Is there salt in here that we missed? Now you are now all sea salt. What did we miss? Fill plane material holder. Sand, silt, sea salt. We have sea salt and sea salt, sea salt and sea salt. What is messed up in our fill planes? Uh, hud fill. Um, rock salt should become sea salt. Richieville fill plane salt diffuse salt normal. Fill planes. see anything named salt in our fill planes. But I think I know where it's messed up at. Uh, so what else? So our on create unknown fill type rock salt. Material on create material holder. Did we miss taking out a rock salt? No. I hate chasing my tail. Fill plain salt. Unknown rock salt on create. Uh, so let's go back in here. Let's go to Richieville. Let's go R O C K S A L T. Where did we miss rock salt? We have it in our HUDs, which is fine. Items XML, which is going to change. Farm silos, central silos. So those are all of our silos. All right, now we're going to have to go into maps. Let's go back into our map i3D and see what I missed. Control F, let's go salt. So we have our salt weight files, one, two, three, four. They're correct. We have our sea salt in our terrain, 
normal diffuse one, two, three, and four. We have our sea salt diffuse, sea salt O1, O2, O3, and O4. We have our sea salt combine layer. I don't see where we're missing anything in the map I3D. change all of these. Can't find resource Ritchieville fill plains. Ritchieville pl fill plains salt. Ritchieville fill plains. Salt. Nothing. Why are you not loading? Well, let's crank up the game again. Let's fix all the. Um, let's get rid of the other errors first, and then we'll crank the game back up and see what we're missing. Let's go rock salt um, items. All right, so the bakery we need to change. Uh, rock salt to sea salt. Uh, lows. Let us go rock salt to sea salt. Angelo's uh, Pizza. Let's change. Rock salt to sea salt. Get rid of all of these errors in the log. Bob's rail sails is going to be sea salt. Sea salt. So you become sea salt. Railroad silo six. Sea salt. Sea salt railroad five goes from rock salt to sea salt. Oh, come on, rock salt becomes sea salt. Salt. Oh, come on, I 
hate when I click off of it. It's become a sea salt. Railroad three. Become sea salt. Railroad O oh, two become sea salt. Railroad O oh, one uh, becomes sea salt. Farm Silo 3, uh, become Sea Salt, uh, Farm Silo 2, Sea salt. Uh, farm silo. We change rock salt to sea salt. Central Station. We are going to get rid of rock salt. It becomes sea salt. Farm Silo. goes from rock salt to sea salt all right so map de items So rock salt becomes sea salt, and that's our only one. Our salt mine we are going to completely remove from the map, but we do have to fix our 110. So our salt mine we're going to completely remove from the map and our fill type goes from rock salt to sea salt to sea salt and that just leaves our salt mine. So let's go to uh, Placeables Global Company. We are going to take our salt mine. We can delete because we're not going to have a salt mine. And our salt mine itself we are going to delete. Let's go into Ritchieville, Maps, Map,
let this load let's go into global company let's grab our salt mine and we're going to completely delete it out of the map so let's save this let this save alright so there is our save now let's go back into game and see if that eliminates all of our errors from trying to convert rock salt over to sea salt. And then, like I said, I'm going to break for lunch soon. I'm going to clean up the mods folder so all that crap that we don't need anymore doesn't even load. Because all, every factory from the Ridgeville map is going to get have to get remade. Because they will no longer work once everything's updated. Uh, so let's go... Let's just repeat what we did. Let's go over to the vehicle shop. let us I'm just gonna lease a truck and a tipper now we should Should be able to put sea salt back in here. So it's let me fill sea salt. It's telling me that I have sea salt in here. Oh, I don't have access to the land. Yes, I don't have access to the land. So let's just buy it all for now. And then I should be able to dump it. So we have our sea salt in the map. Tell me I have sea salt in the truck. I have it on the ground. So let's get out of here. And let's see if that cleaned up our errors in the log. Since our salt mine is no longer loading into the map. So let's go back into our log. Let's just scroll all the way to the top and see what kind of errors we've created. Can't load resource. Salt fuse, salt normal. We're still getting an unknown fill type of rock salt. Shouldn't be any rock salt left. Richieville fill plane salt normal DDS uh, Richieville fill planes aha uh, HUD but 
but it's not telling me I'm missing a HUD. Fill planes, salt, normal, DDS. Let's fill types. Fill planes. So if you want salt, let's just throw a salt normal and a salt diffuse in here and see what happens. So let's go All right, let's create a new folder. Let's go sea salt, diffuse, sea salt, normal. Let's just copy these into here. Let's rename you just salt because that's what it wants. I don't know why, but sometimes you just give the game what it wants. So let's give it a salt normal and a salt diffuse. And then delete that folder. So that will give it the salt textures that it's asking for. But why is it still telling me I have an unknown fill type for material on create? Unknown fill type. Alright, so let's go back through the fill plane material holder. Uh, copper, compost, grape, lettuce, melon, nickel, orange, pear plum, pumpkin, red cabbage, tomato. Alright, so let's go back into our fill plane material holder. Uh, cotton or peanut rice sand. I don't see anything wrong here, so let's go Control F. Uh, so your sea salt, your salt, you are sea salt, sea salt, and sea salt. You are fill type sea salt. Yeah, I have no rock salt at all. Tell me I have no rock salt in the fill plane material holder. I have no rock salt in the fill plane material file. So why is it giving me an error that it's telling me that fill type rock salt for material on create is an invalid? Uh, so if it's not here, let's go to Ritchieville. Let's go to particle systems. Let's go into the effect material holder. And let's see if we have any rock salt left in here. We do. So you are sea salt. You are sea salt. You are sea salt, and that should fix that one, and there should be a particle effect material holder. So let's look at that one. So there's that one, it should be good. Now if we go back in here, uh, so Richieville. <laughs> 
let's go back in game. So I don't want to move on till I have these errors out of the log. Let's go back into career. New farmer. this back up and let's again let's just repeat what we did let's go over to the shop I am going to need some money let us buy the whole map and let's just turn on our speed let's lease us a truck and let's lease us a tipper Should be all right. So if we go back to F eleven, sea salt. So you're telling me I have sea salt in the truck. Let me dump it on the ground so I know that the tip to ground is working. Uh, so now when I, we get out of here I should have no more errors in the log with rock salt. So let's just scroll back up to the top. Fantastic. We have no more errors, so we have rock salts completely eliminated from the map. We have our sea salt back in the map. I can close this because I don't need it open. Uh, See, so you I can close, you I can close. So uh, it is about 1220. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, central time. So now that we have we have copper in the mine in the map and working, we have nickel in the map and working, and all of our rock salt has been converted to sea salt. I'm gonna take about a twenty minute break and I will be back and we're gonna we're gonna rip all of the old mining out of the map and we're going to start putting the new mining uh, it back into the map and then once the mining is completely done then we'll move on to getting all the new animals um, in the map so for now I am going to uh, jump out of here, grab some lunch, um, rest my voice for a few minutes, and I'll be back probably about 20 minutes.